hi guys welcome back to the channel welcome back guys hello everyone hello 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 welcome back welcome back to the channel guys y'all go ahead and hit that like button that subscribe button make sure your post notification bell is on guys so you don't miss a video anytime closet says upload over here anytime is d upload over here you do not want to miss it okay trust me you do not want to miss it we have been doing our clothes pin series and i hope you guys been getting a lot of information because i see i've been getting a lot of views on them so but just make sure you guys go ahead and like the video okay make sure your post notification bell is on guys so you don't miss the video anytime i upload over here like comment and subscribe and definitely share share the channel subscribe and great not red let's go ahead and do this video okay as you guys can see on my table is what clothes pins remember i told y'all we finna get down to the nitty-gritty now of clothes pins yep that's right and like i say there has um there are a lot of ways that you can do these clothes pins yes ma'am yes sir you can do these clothes pins several different ways okay but however you do them it's totally up to you okay it's totally up to you but when i say find your lane find your lane guys okay it does not have to be like everyone else even though we're gonna do them some of them gonna be the same so what that's fine but just find your lane when you're doing it but just have fun when you're doing it okay okay y'all remember when i showed you guys these i um painted these okay i painted these right here myself i was gonna order some but i said nope i'm not doing it and every time i go online i say yep i'm gonna order them no i'm not gonna order any i'm just gonna paint them myself okay and you'll know what they look like when you do it yourself okay as y'all can see the bottle caps y'all have seen me use these bottle caps before y'all if y'all follow me and uh oh i guess it's gonna flip up and y'all see me do the bottle caps in um my id badge reels and stuff this is what i use as well so um but we're not talking about the id badge reels okay um but y'all have seen me use the bottle caps before y'all have seen an inventory haul on these designer um cutouts too so um what i'm trying to say y'all i'm trying to tell y'all about the bottle cap i normally put i was gonna put a hole in the top but i changed my mind i'm not gonna put a hole what i'm gonna do is y'all should already know but i'm fixing to tell you okay y'all remember when i did the drill okay i put me a jump ring here in my little hole i drilled and we'll do one on here today and and this is where my charm is going to go okay so that's why i have this one charm y'all have seen me make these charms before too okay i make my own charms just about when it comes to the bees and stuff like this you can get go to walmart anywhere to the other stores dollar stores and get you some little charms the little beads and stuff seed beads all kind of stuff and buy your little um beads and stuff and you can make your own charms how how you want them to be and we do have the regular metal charms and so forth so you will see me going between these here the bigger ones as well but i'm not showing the big ones right now but right now i'm going to be doing these okay and i'm gonna hang it from here and ta-da guess what instead of using a paper clip instead of using a regular paper clip guess what miss d switched it up over here honey y'all know we don't do boring y'all know we always got something going on over here at closet says yes ma'am all the time so instead of i repeat once again using these plain old clips which are cute too but they're just plain Remember, I told you plain is okay sometimes, but 
eh, not today. Okay, not today. Nope, not today. We're not using the clips, okay? This is our clips. These are our clips. These are our clips. These are our clips. So, I found some the plastic colored clips. And, let me tell you, I was going to get them in wood, but I, nope, I'd say, no, I'm not going to do that either. I'm fixing to show y'all something, too. Um, I'm fixing, I'll show you. And the reason why I went with the plastic clips, why? Because I love the wide mouth that, is, that it has. Yes, I do. And I love the wood, and I'm still going to use the wood as well. But I got these colored clips because why was several different colors in them? Now, I can very well paint these myself. I can very well paint the wood. Let's see. I can very well paint the wood, this, if I want to. But I'm not going to. Not right now. Okay? I'm going to use the color clips. So, this is my first time using these. And I believe I'm going to love them. When I do, I believe I really am going to love using these. And if so, these may be my go-to for show. Yes, ma'am. And I do believe you can get these from anywhere. And I cannot remember where I get these colored ones from, guys, because I didn't have them for so long. Because if y'all remember, I told y'all I was going to. I started doing these at first, and then I stopped and started doing something else. But guess what? Something caught my eye the other day, and I'm like, hmm, I can do that, but I can use this. So, that's why I'm doing this. So, okay. Now, we done got the um, clothes pins and stuff out the way. We can drill them with holes and use them for charms without the holes, but we're going to use a drill for this today. And maybe this one. Okay. Like I said, the bottle caps y'all have seen me use before. This right here is a little dome. We're going to use this. Y'all have seen me use these before too. But I'm going to refresh you guys' memory. I got a Girl Boss. YSL. Chanel. Love Pink. As y'all can see, that's on my table. Okay. Now, um, you would need some little... Eye pins and um head pins for your little charms whenever you're doing your charms, okay? That's why those are there. We're not gonna even talk about them. We're gonna leave those there. And um uh, let's see. Yeah. As y'all can see, this is the badge. The ID badge that I normally use my bottle caps for. That's Betty Boot. She's gorgeous. Okay. This what I use that for too. See? That's what this is right here. This is all the seals of the bottle cap. And you bling it out the way you want to, but we're not going to talk about the bottle cap of the ID badge reels. Because there's different ways that you can use the bottle cap. It does not necessarily has to be on a badge reel. Okay. So. Let's go ahead. And we're going to put these bottle caps. Let me show y'all what I'm doing. Okay. Let's see. But remember. These are just one inch domes, okay? I had a set, and I'm gonna show you this set. I did it on one. I had to hurry and take it off, y'all. You know why? Because, now, y'all see these here? And I believe I had, this is an older set when I very first started, gotta be. And this is hard or something. It's a little thicker than what these are right here, okay? That's why I know these here is an older set. And it has kind of like that little yellow tint to it. I don't like that. I heard and took it off my bottle cap that I was using because I wanted the designer um, 
cut out print. So I said, well, you know what? Let me hurry and take it off. Good thing I did, because you know, once you put these down, it's hard to mess up the, your image. So this is a older set. And like I say, you can tell by looking at it. So I made sure to keep that, but I put that to the side. I probably could use that for something else. But these are my thinner, the thin ones and the newer ones. Okay. Whatever you do, like I say, this is a one inch. You can get these from anywhere. I'm not going to be putting in a description box and so forth. I'm telling you now, you can get these off of Amazon. One inch epoxy um, domes. That's all these are. You can go to Etsy, any vendor, sell these, okay? Now, let's go ahead and let's put this here in here. Let's see. Let's see. But whatever you do, don't touch it. Because if you do, you'll leave that print. And it's going to be on your on your pick. And we don't want to mess up the pick. I hope you guys can see. Just drop it where you want it at. Like so. And mash it down. That's all you do. Make sure you mash it down good. See how I did that one? That one's done. You see how I did that one? That one's done. I mean, literally, mash it good. Okay. If it's off a little bit where you see little a little edge, that's fine. Because they they only fit just so far and so good, okay? On here. We're gonna do another one. I need to order me some more too. So anytime I order these. I order off of Amazon. Okay, y'all have seen me tell y'all where to get these from before. Okay, we're gonna do it again. Drop it where you want it at. Like so. See? And press down. Press, press, press. And what I do once I be done pressed. I let it sit for a minute and I go back and I press again. The girl boss is already down. I've had this here a minute. I've had this. And this paper behind here is just regular paper. You can go on the computer and just write out what you want. You know, it's up to you. We're going to do one more. And we'll have one more to do. Okay. Drop it down where you want it at. Okay, and press down. That's all you do. That's all we're doing. And y'all are gonna love these when we finish doing these. Okay. But today I'm just showing you guys um, how to press these down. How to make these. It's very simple, very easy. And what you can do, go back on some of my other videos I did on the bottle caps for my ID badge reels. And you can see a whole um, video on this. Okay, drop it down. Press. Press down. That's all we're doing. I love working with bottle caps. When I first, first started my business, this is what I started doing. If y'all follow me, y'all know that. I started out with the bottle caps, ID badge reels. Baby, I sold so many of these things here. At first, I was just selling them off more. Not off the website, but just selling them to family, friends, and nurses, and stuff like that. I just opened up an Etsy shop and just put them on, online. And I sure enough went to selling them then. So... That's it. Now, your bottle caps are done. Okay? Y'all have seen me do the charm. We're not going to even go through the steps of the charm. Just get you the eye pin or head pin. Insert little holes or whatever you want to go. That's it. Twist. That's it. Y'all have seen me do these. We're not going to go through that step of doing that. Now, but what y'all will see me do is this right here. We're not using that. 
I'm gonna close that. We can all we can always use these, okay? I'm gonna leave that out because I may have something to say about that later. Okay. Now, what we're gonna do, what I want to do is we have a hole in here, okay? Y'all see me use this drill the other day. I told you guys, remember, y'all are definitely gonna see me keep using this drill, okay? So, put it on the side you want the hole to be on and what side you want your um, image or your whatever you're doing to be on before you drill the hole. See how cute that's gonna be? Okay. Um, yeah, I want it on this side. So, remember I told y'all about that guide right there? It's better to have the guide. Them little lines, I like them when they like that. They're, it's hard when, when it's just straight. For me, anyway. Okay, this is my second time using this. So, make sure you press down. This is not for children. This is not recommended for children. Okay. I wanted it kind of close to the edge, but it's okay. Cause guess what? Even though even though okay, we're done with the drill for right now. I'm gonna get my where is that? My poke tool and I'm just gonna do this. See, we can use our poker tool for everything. If y'all been following me, y'all know how we what we do with the poker tools. Check out some of the videos. And okay, I'm glad that did that. You see this little knit right here? Don't worry about it. Get you some black paint or a marker or something and just cover that up. Okay. The only thing you're gonna do is put a jump ring in between here. Now, let's try putting a hole in this but before we put the hole in this let me show y'all remember i told you you can preset this right remember i told you you can use e6000 you see the reason why it's white right here that's because i used super glue last night i said let me do this just to see and if you can see right here you can tell i super glued it i use super glue right here and honey, it is not going anywhere on both sides. So that's why you see a little bit of this right here, whiteness to it right there. That's why. But don't worry, because we have something to cover that up. See? This is going to be so pretty, baby. And I'm going to love this. Okay, let's go ahead and get this started. Let's see. Let me see. I hope I can... Cause I want to, I want charms on all of these. Ooh, baby, yeah, yes, sir. Your girl is gonna like that. She is definitely gonna like that. Okay, I'm gonna clean that up some. Okay. Um, like I say, just scrape off the little bit that's on there. Look at that. Made a perfect hole. I was thinking about, ooh, look at that. Girl, yeah. That's a perfect hole right there. Okay, we're going to go ahead and um put a jump ring in here. We're going to put a jump ring in here. I like using the, um, this jump ring here I have is the, the gun metal. I love using the gun metal, especially with my black. But, um, <clears throat> let me see. Let me see. Um, if I can find a silver jump ring i need to order me some just a whole set of just jump rings period okay. okay i found one and let's 
let's just use the um the split ring for the bottom let me keep two out in case i want to do something different with that okay all right i'm hoping this video don't be long if it is a little long guys just just you can go through the video and get what you want out of it it'll be fine so now we're taking our jump ring we're going to put it in here Ooh, honey like this here the girl is going to love this loving this i ain't even got to work with this that hard i'm just going to squeeze it together like so hold this i'm gonna take my little round those flowers and pull that apart like that um, and i think this that hard one too it's not okay all right ah! but look look what it did now look look guys look look what i just did because i pressed down on it duh i have to remember this is plastic miss d look look oh my goodness oh we finna have a problem that's our fail that's my epic fail in this video i'm not editing no video and i'm glad it did do that okay so i'm not editing this video i'm i'm glad it happened like that so i can show y'all my mess ups okay like i say we all mess up so when you see them do them videos don't make it look like they don't um, mess up yes they do yes they do girl and it's okay to mess up you learn Okay, we're going to try this again. Remember I told y'all, when y'all, I mess up, y'all mess up too. Hey, but we're going to get it right. We're going to get it right. Okay, let me be that right now. Let me, let me do this one more again. Let me see if I can do this one more again. Maybe if I, let me see. Uh oh, y'all see the, make sure y'all got a good handle on it. okay we did it again so maybe guess what i'm not gonna do this time i'm not going to put this in here like this now let me try this one more again okay but i'm kind of afraid that i won't be able to use the the metal hook on here for the charm you want me to tell you why because you know what? If it did that and I was just trying to put it on, remember, don't do it as hard. But I want—I wonder, I wonder, I'm wondering if, if I did use this, will it, and I end up having to open and close like this. Excuse me. My stomach growling. Like, will it be... Let me see. Will that mess with it as well to mess up or break? Okay. All right. Okay, this time I didn't press down on this clip. Okay. That's it. So, now we have one here okay if we don't finish this video out i can come back and i can always show you guys the extra charm i put here and how i decorated it okay so let's not get discouraged right there a little bit okay so this is what we're gonna do i'm gonna leave this here because that was our epic fail my epic fail on that so 
guess what I'm going to do? Like I said, this video was just to show you guys the different ways on our series of how and what you can, different clothespins you can use, how you can dress them up, and this is how Miss D dresses hers up, and we're doing it designer style, okay? Yep, yep, yep. Designer inspired style. So, guess what I'm fixing to do right now? Since, hmm... I don't think it'll come off as easy. So let's go ahead and do this. <coughs> let's go ahead and do this. We're gonna go ahead and use some E6. Um, we you can use E6 styles or adhesive of your choice. And y'all know this is my go-to. When I don't can't get to my big on my small jaws, I like to use this little one. So I'm so ready to decorate this is pitiful but make sure you have more than enough on here and let it sit overnight okay oh yes baby I'm, I think I'm gonna love these see yeah that's it like right that Yep, this is gonna be per tay. That's one, and we're gonna do one more. I'm gonna do the red because I did this in red and black charm to go with this, and then I'm gonna show y'all on the next video what we did, what I did with these, and how you can plan your own. Um, use these for clips instead of using the paper clips all the time you can use these for clips too and i'm going to show y'all another way you can also use these okay so y'all definitely stay tuned let's go ahead and put this on here i want it this way you guys make sure you your post notification bell is on so you don't miss a video anytime we upload over here at closet of sass and y'all see what I did, right? Y'all see what I did? I put it mainly where? On that metal part. If you And what I did, I put extra glue to make sure to hear when it goes further up. This is going to be a pretty one, too. I already know. I'm going to let that sit there for a minute. And just maybe... I can add that charm. Just maybe. Okay, that's one. Um, let me show y'all how to cover that up right quick. Okay, put my lid back on my um, E6000. We're not going to use that more, no more today. The little nicks and pings. Just nail polish. Y'all see. That's all it is. Just nail polish. Nail polish my go-to. Y'all already know. Y'all already know what to do. See that? Can't even really tell it. See? That's it. And... That is it. I think I'm going to use this one for this one like this. I think I'm going to use that one. And I have some more black clothespins. This one is definitely going on a, a um black one. Or I might put it on a pink one. But I want to see how this one do first. That's why I want to do one. Because I definitely need to see how this one do first. But anyway... But that is it for this video, guys. I just thought I'd come in and show you guys how. And I always try to go back up. Because it will slide. With your pins. Make sure they're straight. And how you want them. So in the next video, you guys will see me. 
finish doing these i think i'm gonna go ahead and do these on here with you guys so you will see me finish these up okay but this video was to finish showing you guys to show you guys what you what else you can use these bottle caps for okay they're not just for um keychains they're not just for id badges look what i just did and what did i do it with a regular clothespin a regular clothespin and what else did I do add my little embellishment but what else did I do my epic fail of what pressing it down and I'm pressing it against this remember do not press against this if you're gonna use this like this but what I what I'm curious about when I do this here but I think it's going to be fine because it's more than enough room than this is. What happened was, y'all saw yourself, I ended up pressing too hard trying to put this in there. And I have to remember this seals plastic. Okay? And like I said, I didn't had these a while. So, yeah. And make sure there's enough glue on here. Uh, your adhesive 6000. I wouldn't use super... Um, hot glue unless you're going to use it with your e6000 and you guys have seen me do that before too so but i probably do one on here to show you guys but since i'm going to do them like this and let them sit overnight and then in my next video we'll just go ahead and finish out because i want you guys to actually see um how we finish putting these on here okay but this is our epic fail which is cool that's good and i'm glad that did that on here so like i say you will continue to see me use the drill you will continuously see me use the drill. You will continue to see me use this, okay? But whatever you guys do, go pick up you some clothespins. Try these out. I'm going to try these out, and hopefully I like them. So, yeah. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure your post notification bell is on so you don't miss a video anytime I upload. And you will definitely need these here. These are one-inch epoxy domes, okay? For your bottle caps these are one inch bottle caps amazon amazon etsy just search for your vendors they're on there there will be no link in the description box for this i just told you where to go and what the name of them were okay all right i'm out guys make sure you guys like comment and subscribe to the channel make sure your post notification bell is on guys so you don't miss a video anytime i upload over here at closet of sash you make sure you share the channel continuously like the video all my newcomers thank you for supporting and the ones that's been here a minute with me rocking with your girl i appreciate you and thank you i'm out